Hey everyone, a very warm welcome to Fun Learn with Dipti. Today we are going to solve exercise 1.1. Our first question is 140. Now we have to think of the smallest prime number by which it can be divided. Okay, so in this case, the uh, smallest prime number is 2. It can be divided by 2. So 2 7s are 14 and 2 zeros are 0. Again, this 70 can be divided by 2. So 2 3s are 6 and 2 5s are 10. Okay. Now this 35 can be divided by 5. We can't divide it with 2 or 3. So the next prime number is 5. 5 7s are 35. Now 7 is a prime number. So 7 1s are 7. When we get 1, we have to stop the process. Therefore, 140 is equals to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 7, which is equals to 2 square multiplied by 5 multiplied by 7. Okay. Now the next question. Next question is 156. Now again we have to do the same process. We have to think of a smallest prime number by which this number can be divided. Here in this case also that the smallest prime number is 2. So 2 7s are 14, 2 8s are 16. This can also be divided by 2. So 2 3s are 6 and 2 9s are 18. This can be divided by 3, 3 1s are 3 and 3 3s are 9. 13 is a prime number, it can be divided only by 13. So 13 1s are 13. Now 156, we can write it as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 13. And this can be written as 2 square into 3 into 13. Okay. We'll move to the third question, which is 3825. Now, this number can be divided by 3. It can't be divided by 2. Why? Because the last number is not an even number. So we have to move to the next number and how we can decide whether it is divisible by 3 or not. We have to add the digits and if that digit is divisible by 3, then the entire uh, number can be divided by 3. Okay. So in this case, this number is divided by 3. Okay. So 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6, 3 7s are 21 and 3 5s are 15. Okay, we'll get this number when we divide it with 3. Now, we have to think of a number which divides this number completely. So, the number is 3. 3 fourths are 12. And 3 twos are 6. And 3 fives are 15. Okay. Now, this number can't be divided by 2 or 3. So we have to move to the next prime number that is 5. 5 eights are 40 and 5 fives are 25. Now this number can be divided by 5. 5 ones are 5, 5 sevens are 35. Now 17 is a prime number. It can be divided by 17 only. 17 ones are 17. Therefore, 3, 8, 2, 5, it is equals to 3 into 3 into 5 into 5 into 17. Okay. It can be written as 3 square into 5 square into 17. Now, our next number is 5, 0, 0, 5. Okay, now let's divide it with the prime number. So 5 is that 
the smallest prime number by which this can be divided so 5 ones are 5 5 zeros of 0 5 zeros are 0 5 ones are 5 now this number can be divided by 7 7 ones are 7 7 fours are 28 and 7 threes are 21 now this number can be divided by 11 11 ones are 11 11 threes are okay now this 13 is a prime number so 13 divided by 13 will give you 1 so we can write 5005 as 5 multiplied by 7 multiplied by 11 multiplied by 13 okay now next question is 7 4 2 9 This number can't be divided by 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13. So the next prime number is 17 and it is divisible by 17. 17 fours are 68, 17 threes are 51 and 17 sevens are 119. Now this number can be divided by 19. So 19 twos are 38 and 19 threes are 57. Now 23 is a prime number. So we'll divide it with 23. We'll get 1. Therefore, 7, 4, 2, 9 is equals to 17 multiplied by 19 multiplied by 23. We will continue this exercise in our next video. Keep watching.